A baby on board story you have to hear to believe. A Hartford County woman's baby decided he was not going to be born in the hospital. Instead, he decided to come into the world right in the car. WJZ is live. George Sola is meeting with the mom and baby tonight to get the full story. George. Good evening, Mary. Alyssa Leitner was on the way to the hospital during the first telltale signs that her baby was coming. Within a matter of minutes, the birth of that baby would change several lives. A little man with a big story to tell. I wanted to go natural, maybe not that natural. This five pound, nine and a half ounce bundle of joy is baby Asher, AKA Philly. We'll get to why in a second. My goal with him was not to be the hospital for, all, for long. His mom, Melissa, already a mother of three, had a whole plan in place to prepare for his arrival, which also included a different birthday. In what might be expected of a defiant teenager, Asher decided to not only be born a day early, but also nowhere near the hospital. Obviously, you know, I waited a little too long. With her contractions starting earlier in the day, Alyssa, alongside her doula, a woman trained to assist another during childbirth, were en route to the hospital when it happened. Didn't plan to give birth in the car. Didn't plan to do any of that. Newborn baby Asher born in the seat of the car on Cavalry Road near Philadelphia Road in Abingdon, hence the nickname. By now you might be asking, did they ever call 911? You bet. The call to 911 was made and received here at the Hartford County Emergency Operations Center, but baby Asher was waiting for no one. Two minutes. About two minutes. Operator in training John Riggin taking the unconventional call. Two minutes between when the call was made and when the baby was born. He's a little bit, a few steps behind. <laughs> well, she's having a baby and um, not something you hear every day on the phone. But with his supervisor riding shotgun for the call and the doula on the other end of the line, baby and mom were transported safely to the hospital. It was uplifting and refreshing to be involved in a, in a call like that. Mom and baby also pretty happy too. His birth was so dramatic, but he's so not. You know what I mean? It's like, wow. Yeah, it was love at first sight, of course. I mean, the pain, it goes away. It goes away. And just how cute is that baby? Now, John, the 911 operator did call Alyssa at the hospital to check on the baby. Mom says that the EMS that was with her was also in training. She says as far as she's concerned, both get a passing grade in her book. Live tonight, George Solis reporting for WJZ. Absolutely. Two thumbs up. Asher is a beautiful little baby boy, George. Thank you. Or Philly, we could call him. <laughs> Mom and baby are expected to go home from the hospital tomorrow afternoon. Could you imagine being the 911 operator in training? Uh, uh, hello. I need help over here. <laughs> you take over, <laughs> right? right?